Hey, yo. Hey, hey. Welcome to Friday Night Fights, everyone. Today we got a special guest commentator joining us, Ben, from the Dice Time Podcast. How you doing, Ben? Good. How are you, Joe? I'm excellent. I'm hyped for this. And Sean, you're out there as well. How you doing over there? Hey, in the studio? I'm here. Uh, ben replaced me. Well, really, Joe replaced me, and then <laughs> Ben replaced Joe, and and I've been relegated to a voice. <laughs> <laughs> That's all right, you've, man. Uh, you're the you're the man behind the glass tonight. You're the man uh, in the booth, right? <laughs> I, I have a face. I have a face made for radio. I think is what the phrase is. So, <laughs> oh man, we all. We I like all. to think he's. He's moved on to the, he's the force ghost now, and now we've got the new master and apprentice moving. Yeah, yeah, fair. That's right. He's the force ghost. He's the disembodied voice now. Yeah, just force ghosting those cameras all over the table, right? Yeah, we'll we'll definitely <laughs> give you guys a big run out. Big shout out, actually, though, uh, hopefully. And let us, please let us know, as always, when we start audio, make sure there's no echo, make sure you can hear us all. But uh, 28 folks already in chat hanging out with us, so make sure you say hi uh, don't forget at the end oh, of this oh, Friday oh, night fight, oh. also giving away a Train Studio t-shirt, which I said uh, on the Hobbycast last night. So if you were in chat and you comment and you were in last night's chat, you don't have to be in both places, but everyone's eligible to win. So uh, Al Paz, friend of the show, is in and out, but he is saying hello. Actually, he said, sup, nerds. So, <laughs> sup, you know. Sup, Al. Sup, Al. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right. Before we preview the fight, let me let me just handle this a little bit and pe and run people through what's going on here tonight. So, first off, uh, let's check out this uh, because this is what's happening right now. So, as you guys can see, hopefully you guys can see, got some deployment zones going on. Now, small caveat: these are very close to um, accurate. Now, remember they're slightly suspended, so if there's a little bit of in and out here the models are correct the overlays are loose representations they're pretty darn close looks like maybe those those shore troopers might have uh i'm not sure if they reconned out a little bit but they look like they're have escaped my zone a little bit so um or maybe those are the droids rather sorry i'm thinking the, the droids mike's droids might might probably are mostly accurate are they out a little bit mike Yeah, fair enough. Okay, so so that's kind of what we have going on right there. Um, they are playing, and we'll get to the missions here in a second. But they are playing recover, so we're just marking that center one, and then obviously we'll have some uh, some ones moving around. Um, the action cams for you guys tonight are going to be. Uh, Jace, can you just move darkness descends for us there? So Jace has uh, obviously divulged that. So that's going to be yeah. one cam for you. You guys are going to have an in-game close cam for you guys. You're going to have a cam here that you can see both. We'll have an uh, overhead cam that you guys can see the whole thing. And obviously Ben and Joe are here uh, to commentate for you. And then we have an in-game action cam. So when the action requires, I will be Johnny on the spot, zoom in, and the guys will uh, let you know um, what it is that we're showing and they'll let me know what you need to see. So uh, for the most part tonight, I'm gonna just kind of be here. Uh, also, the players cannot hear Joe or Ben. So any advice or tactics or banter or, hey, that wasn't a very optimal move um all of that will happen and they will not be able to hear that so um that'll be super fun so i'm gonna let you guys uh take it away and you guys want this one or how about you just go here and you guys can just kind of talk about what's happening tonight i'm out actually you know you know what sean can you can you actually go back to the the um view you were just at because i want to talk lists here yeah you yep. bet yeah so all right right off the bat i'm noticing uh both players with an aggressive bid and Mike just inching out Jace by one point with a 786 to the 787. So both players, this is something I find very interesting about the current state of Legion in the in the competitive scene. Both players electing to take what was traditionally considered quite a large aggressive bid, and yet still Jace losing the bid with a 13 point bid. Losing. Yeah, I That's feel like the the battle deck is, is is pretty important now that we have a whole bunch more options for it. So it's been, uh, I've, I've seen the bids been growing like way, well over what they ever were in any competitive scene before, at least in my opinion. Yeah. I, I've I, never I, seen like 14 point bid. I'm just like, I, I feel like I've only seen that like one or two other events when it mattered at one point but then everyone was just kind of like yeah you know well it's, I'll, I'll tell you what flashbacks for me of year one michigan gt uh when key positions was still broken 
That's, and yeah, that's what I was thinking of. I took a I took a fourteen point bid, and I thought it was the most obnoxious bid ever, because most of the time the local guys were taking like three to five points in a bid yeah. if they were taking a bid, and and I got outbid by someone took a seven eighty. Like, I literally got outbid and lost on key positions in round one. Jeez. This is, like, when Han and Leia... Han, like, just came out. So this is really the early days. Oh, yeah. Um, man, yeah, but we're seeing that kind of stuff again. So, um, all right, looks like we got Jace playing uh, Vader in some dewbacks. We've got Mike playing, um, like, kind of an early Clone Wars starter set release traditional... Uh, triple Droidica list with Grievous. Mm -hmm. um, honestly, I like both. I, I like both, and I really like the prospect of yeah. leveraging those Droidicas with their suppressive yeah. keyword to yeah. suppress out Vader. Because yeah. I believe we're seeing um, the operative. Is this the operative profile? No, it's actually Commander Vader. I think so it's never be mind. Commander. Yeah. Never mind. That's Commander Vader. For some reason, I thought it was operative, but yeah. So actually, that's interesting because. Okay, now now we're looking at the Empire having essentially an infinite courage bubble as long as Vader's alive. So maybe that suppressive droid uh, uh, spam is not going to be as effective. We'll have to see how that plays out. Yeah, it's possible. It depends on maybe maybe the goal is to, to clear Vader off the board like as fast as possible and then, and then suppression panic everybody else. True. And you know uh, what? Something I'm something I'm thinking as well. Actually, the Droidicas might be really uh, with three of them. I mean, that's six bases. That that's actually very doable. So yeah. I'm, I'm curious to see what's going to happen there. <laughs> yeah. Uh, well, I'm, I'm we... more curious to see this mortar. Uh, that the, I I think I've found a reason why I want to root for the Empire today is because one of these mortars has deployed up on top of the, one of these towers. Nice. Yeah, I saw that. And I'm like, all right. <laughs> <laughs> I can get behind that. <laughs> that guy's just sitting there the whole game, but hey. He can't... Okay, so I believe the players are playing Recover the Supplies. Is that correct, John? Yeah, yeah. yeah. So we'll jump... I was just going to say, the players are actually ready. So if you guys are ready, I'm going to hit the turn one uh, screen and uh, we'll get we'll get cards and everything rolling here. So, all right. So he, here we go. Turn one. Players are going to... Uh, you know what? We're going to do... Yeah, take it. Fantastic. Darkness Defense divulged, so we got the infiltrate. Uh, yeah. One of the one of the downfalls of doing that is if you want to win priority, the opponent just needs to play a two or a one pip, and right, they and you automatically it, so. win, right? And, so that's the yeah. Um, just a couple other points here, just a, a little bit of uh, chat coming in, chatter here, so or chatter coming in chat um we will mark the units on the side when they are deleted uh they'll just be denoted by a red so you guys can just count up the activations that are there they're kind of uh segmented out so we'll have that we also have the full dice cam so you guys will catch all the the dice um views as well so don't uh, don't panic you guys will see uh that so if you guys are ready we'll uh interesting to know just for chat to know both players who are playing in the game are now typing in chat so that they are entered for the t-shirt because that's how we do things here so awesome fair Ooh. enough all right Hang boys on let's... a minute all right well okay go ahead and then i gotta i gotta address something that just got said in chat that i don't like oh we got the three pip we're still rolling for priority all right yeah, they are rolling for priority, so the roll will come in here. Uh, let's see. It is. There we go. That's Mike. So uh, players will flash the activation tokens for us underneath as well, just so we can kind of keep track as best we can here. So, Got a question coming in from chat saying, is that how you would play CAD's card as well? Card as well. I believe that's in reference to divulging, and the answer to that is yes. Yep. So you, you reveal it during the deployment step in order to get its effects, and it just stays face up, and you have to play it on turn one. Which, that's to... like a small cost, honestly. Right. If, that, if that were the only cost of the card, I think that's a fair price to pay, and honestly, I'd pay it every time. Mm -hmm. I've, I've only played one game with Cat right now, but I love how all the tokens play. Yeah, really same. Fun. Same. Uh... Two other things in chat real quick. One, Bob Swain is here, my hey, less attractive co-host on, on Down. Um, 
my goodness, my I'm not, I'm not surprised. <laughs> All right, so what do we got going on here? We got Vader activating first. Vader's ready to go. Look at those sweet tokens. All right, so Vader looks like he is he. Oh, he's just moving up. I think he's going to do a strafe, saber throw strafe, if I can guess. He's Ooh. looks like he's checking some ranges here, seeing if he can get an out-of-cover shot if possible. I don't know if he's going to have it from this angle. It looks like that rock is probably in the win. So, yeah, I can only get reflexes more. Two is the highest that there is in the game so far. How big do they do for the mouse? Looks like he's taking it. Yeah. Flexes. He's getting taking his dodge token here. Ah, uh, okay. I don't yeah, think he's, I don't think he threw a saber. I think he would maybe just moved Vader. I'm not. To... I, I don't see why. Yeah. yeah. Let's see. Are he's looking for something? Uh, Jace, there? Chase, what did you do with uh, Vader when you moved him up? You uh, did... Move claim. Move move claim. Yeah. Move, move claim. claim. Oh, he's claiming. Uh, move claim. Yeah. Yeah. Flexes. Aggressive turn one box. Oh, we got a probe droid coming in. Yep. Getting that shot of Vader. Yeah. Yeah, there he is. He's claiming that objective there. Okay. Yep. Yeah, I see it. I see it. Looks like he might he might still have some sort of line of sight blocking benefit there as well. Okay. And I will aim and I will shoot at red. Cool. You have to be range to and line also said we might have lost the audio when we were yeah so, yeah you yeah that is true actually i did turn the audio off on that one but i will if people if people want it on i just was trying to keep it a little cleaner but if people want it i can turn it on on all cams so that's fair okay. <laughs> and uh more shade is getting thrown in chat i can see the other four but they're all blocked so three white, with an A, and your right. Uh, critical one. And two suppression. Two suppression. Okay. One. Oh yeah, you're right. Yep, he rolled. Search. Yep. There it is. All right. Who's he? Uh, uh, he looks like he's suppressing those droids back there. One of those groups. Where are you now? Yeah. Where is uh? Where is Grievous? Is he in that back line by that base? You know, I can't really see. I can't really tell right now. Um, is uh, is there any way we can figure out where uh, Grievous is on the board here? Uh, yeah, I can show you. Uh, you can switch to the room. <laughs> yeah, no, I'll uh, I'll show you. I got a I got an angle here right. for you. All right. So there you go. Ah, okay, yeah, that's what I thought. He's by the he's by the uh, bunker back there. Yeah, okay. He's gonna make the uh, he's gonna make the approach that way, slow and steady. Yeah, I'm curious to see if he's just gonna try to crash into Vader and fight him. I feel like if he were gonna do that, he would have deployed next to those other B ones over there, that mm. are up by that like little C, because that would have been a quicker scale over that, and then just dive into him right there. Core token. Speaking of token. Uh, how Martin token arrived today, boys. Thanks. Of course. Hope you enjoy them. They're they're pretty sweet. I I got mine a while ago, and we've been using them in our in our bat reps and stuff that we recorded, and they are they are super satisfying to just. It's a click of poker chips, man. Nice. Just so nice. So I can see those two. Uh, aim and fire, heavy cover. Okay. And Robert in chat saying good evening from Michigan. Good evening. There you go. I just cleaned that feed up a little bit. So that uh, probe cam is going to give us a little bit of trouble. I'll clean this cam up here, and then you guys will get a real sharp image. Okay. <sighs> so.
So are we getting more? Is that more mortar shots? And two more suppression. Looks like. Two more, yep. yeah, two, two more, more suppression, suppression yep. destroys, yeah. Yeah, the top down, so you got, you got, uh, obviously you got droids along the bottom and Empire along the top there, so just trying to, just trying to make sure you guys don't miss anything, and <laughs> these guys are skipping back and forth all around, so we'll, we'll do our best to keep up here. <laughs> Sweet. I got, I got Mike to uh, switch, switch the hat around so he doesn't block his, uh, his movement there. Oh look, another four. All right. Let's see what yeah. he's gonna be doing here. Yeah, draw his core. I think some shore is gonna start moving. Well, uh, okay. I, I guess, I guess shores have to. I just realized there's, there's only shores as, as core. <laughs> yeah. So, shores all right. I was just like, all right, yeah. As opposed to. Oh, never mind. It's just all shores. That's right. Uh, yeah. So, just a question here about boxes being pointed out. Let me do this really uh, nice thing for you, Jace. Do you want to point for me? Okay. So we got a box that's going to be. Let me see. It's going to be right at the top. So there's a box right here for you guys, and then we got a box right here for you guys. And let me just here, let me just option this out here. I will option that and then option. We got another box right here. And then we got another box right here. And then obviously we got the middle box and we can uh, point that out there for you. Sorry, I just made a small dice box for you guys so you guys can see in this in this overlay as well. Yeah, watch. It's gonna happen. No. Oh. You got also resting your secretion. You bet. Yep. Alright, well big ups, we're good. Big ups in chat here, 51 thumbs up, 26 hearts. We appreciate that, guys. 35 viewers hanging out with us. This is awesome. Do us a favor, share it out, let people know what's happening here. Legion Academy, Friday Night Fights. You know, we're putting in all this work. We definitely want to have you guys here hanging out with us. Just jumped to 41, so fantastic. Good job. All right, core token being pulled. Yeah, you want this core? Yeah. Not sure if you guys caught that double, double move touch objective there. I'm just gonna I'm gonna make these objectives disappear. Just but uh, we'll move them back out whenever you guys uh, need them. So just let us know. All right, so we got some range being measured here. Looks like we're seeing maybe checking range to the do back. I'm, I know. Yeah, I'm, I'm curious to see what these do backs are gonna are gonna do. So they've actually got the range weapon, the T21 Blaster. So I wonder yeah. if he's going to try to go for max range um, and use Relentless to take the pot shot and then maybe keep them sort of distanced so that he can potentially charge those B1s that aggressively move towards Vader, like in a later turn or something. I mean, um, so so one thing I'm noticing on these Dewbacks is they both have Endurance. Yes. So, so which is, you know, a good... But uh, mm -hmm. that means he could probably separate them from Vader a bit and not get them too suppressed or get them get them panicked or anything. He can sure. probably play them a little separate from Vader and not have to keep them within his, his infinite range three bubble. Sure. Uh, if, if people are interested, the cards are now up there too, if you're not familiar with the Dewbacks or the T21 Blaster. Beautiful, yeah. You can see the critical too. That's going to be the, the best part about um, taking that weapon is just trying to fish for crits through cover. 
Um, I personally think that endurance feels mandatory on Dubaks uh, over oh, yeah. tenacity. Oh, At yeah. first, I was like, "Oh man, tenacity that makes you pretty strong," and you can combo it with new ways to motivate them and stuff. But the more I've seen it in practice, and the more I've um, watched people play, I'm, I'm thinking endurance just feels too necessary because you really need to clear those suppression that you give yourself from spurring. Absolutely. And it looks like uh, Jace going with at least one spur here. Oh, yeah. They're, he is moving. I th can he get in is the question. Well, let's, uh, let's quickly jump in. Let's, let's quickly jump into that. Give it to suppression. That's uh, uh, spurring to do, but he's ready for the charge on the. It's more core coming in. Fail on that rally, but droids don't care. Yep. Unless they're too far from Grievous. Is that what just happened? Did he just panic off the just board? panic oh, off the table. Oh my gosh. <laughs> wow. Oh, I, didn't shoot back. I, I didn't want that. No, I, I not, that not, that's what we just saw. We just saw a panic off the table. Panic off table, eh? Yeah. yeah. Oh, man. Yes, so, panic off table. It's like we have our first full dead squad. You could probably turn them red. I was I was literally about that to was just say anything special the, uh, in that unit. The Empire okay. list here is built for Six. like suppressing real bad. It's like everything in here is built to suppress yeah. you. And try to get you to panic, and I was like, "But these droids aren't gonna care." But nope. and then as soon as right before I say it, there goes some droids right off the board edge, like right in the start of round one. Jeez, that, that's there a hard go. blow to start. With. And you, you know go. what? Mark There's unit. Still... Yeah, thank you, Sean. That looks great. They're still um, most likely uh, Vader's command card that could suppress <laughs> suppress everything out. I mean. We yep. say droids don't care about suppression, but they still care about three to four to six to eight suppression. I mean, yeah, you know, it, it is what it is. When you got triple mortar, I mean, come on. That was a good smart play by Jace. That was. Just to the edge good job, Jace. So just at range three. You know, he's like the back's moving forward for another, uh, yeah. for, for, he's looking for more the, right. with the other dude back. I think he's going for the shot I'll on take Grievous. Four. I'll take nice. four red. If, no, here's the, here's the thing. So, B once and Grievous are the only the only things in Mike's army that can actually score because Droidicus can't actually claim the supplies, right? So, just go slightly slower on the dice rolls. Yeah, if you hone in on the if you hone in on the that looks like a crit into a block, so no damage coming through, which is suppression on Grievous. But if, if you hone in on the B1s and get them off the table, I mean, that really cripples Mike. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, we'll have to see. That's one way I, to do it. Just I take think out everyone just... who can claim an objective. Oh, if, if I'm bet. Jace, I, I pick a B1 squad that I can see every turn, and I just aim shoot with all three mortars and go, yep. deal with six suppression. I don't even care what to kill. Yeah, I think I, maybe like, he's picking different targets to try and panic them like that but i mean honestly yeah i would just be picking i would just single one squad out at a time and just get rid of them yeah the other crazy thing is like if you look at the position of that mortar troop that's just like on top of the temple there's literally no counter like grievous cannot scale up there right. like you just have to shoot it through its heavy cover and kill it or else it's just gonna rain suppression on you the entire game 
and it's totally it, safe it, to do so. It, I might have said this before on uh, on on Dice Time already, but I did play a game with uh, with Rex with that jetpack where he was able to get himself up on a, a platform with just enough space for one base, and that's pretty. And and Grievous wasn't able to come up and tear him apart. Uh, and that's exactly what that mortar pretty much is doing right there. So uh, I need a name for this mortar trooper by the end of the night. Maybe Chad can help us out with that. Yeah, because uh, he's definitely my favorite man on the board right now. Just the just the dude up on top of the tower, no way down. So three. Oh boy, what is this? So Jason Jason Prince saying this is one reason B twos are good. Courage two. Yeah, I definitely agree. Yeah, with that's that. true. I definitely agree with that. So yeah, they've uh, got their strengths and weaknesses for sure. And that short they range just kind of hurts, but once they're in, they're, they they do some damage, and they're they're pretty defensive. If you keep them in uh, heavy cover. So was that a Droidica shot that we just that, saw on that, that back? Yeah, that was a that was a Droidica shot. Uh, Mike, are you able to point out which Droidica that was for us? Okay, perfect. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yep. Yeah, those Droidica shot there. Yep. What do we have going on here? So we got checking range for. Oh, yeah. he's moving some shores up. Yeah, yeah. yeah, maybe trying to take just the range four shot for now. Um, at those droids. Yeah. And likely we'll we'll have heavy cover based on the angle I'm seeing here, but I think Jace just electing to try to leverage that critical keyword at range four and see what he can get. That's uh -huh. fair. It's not a, not a bad turn one thing. This is what the Empire does best typically so far. Critical one, heavy cover. Looks like that's two hits that I can see. Three hits. So three one hits, going. So through. we got one through at least. Yep. Likely they fail because the droids. And that's one exactly what happened. One suppression. Wow. One more suppression. Yeah. It is over to you. That was my two action. Cool. All right. Let's see what Mike's gonna do here. Mike is picking up his range stick. Going to the bag. Pulls a core unit. Did he? Or no, is that a droidica? Can't. See. Yeah, he, he didn't ah, flash, see, he... but it is a droidica, yeah. That's fine. Okay. Yep. No, that's cool, Mike. That's good. Yeah. I'm, so I'm Mike assuming it's a droidica. It's good. Yeah. I see Mike has contracted painter's hands. Uh, no, he's actually pulling an Alpaz, and he just finished painting those right before he put them on the table. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, I mean, if you brought them unpainted, they weren't going to roll as well. That's, <laughs> that's true. That's true. And. Looks like he is just electing to go for the double move here, yep. getting set up for the next turn. Jace pulling a core token. Yep. Jace, can you so pull that token off too? Another shore trooper. These this has been are, an explosive these, round one. For I know these. I, these I, I, I love the pace. These guys are the yeah. These guys are making me uh, work the work the angles here. I'm, so I know I'm yeah. like I'm like just trying to keep up. Well, you know what? I'll, in all that uh, in all that rashness, I think I actually forgot to uh, start this timer up. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to assume that those guys have burned off no more, no more than 30 minutes. So I'm just going to give them a full two hour, which I do not think that this pace, this is going to they're going to struggle to finish this game. So yeah, no way. This game's this game's going to be over in 45 minutes. Boom. We played two of them. Totally. A <laughs> but who's going to win? I mean, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm. Grievous I'm trying to start coming in and just Grievous could. Off Just make it. Yep. Stay. There we go. Sorry, I just focused up that up top cam for you guys a little bit better too. So, um, man, big big ups in chat here. Seventy four thumbs up. Forty six hearts tonight. Fifteen Ben. Fifteen laughs at Ben's jokes and twenty one oh my gods. So. And 41 people hanging out, which is awesome. Totally appreciate that, guys. We would hate to do it for just a few people, but we would. So uh, yeah, thanks, we'll thanks for everyone to come hanging out with us tonight. Anyway. Yeah, All right, looks like it looks like he's going getting an arm. It's like yeah. Jace is going to take a shot at those droids. Mm -hmm. um, he's leveraging the ankle nicely. He gets two. I think it's just just, just crushing. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I can't give you that. Yep. Oh, 
All right, waiting on Mike to see what he's got. Mike's gonna flash us a nice one with a deck. There it is, Droidica. All right, I'll come, to, I'll, I'll come down. I'll come down. I'll come down here because this will likely capture that for us. And and honestly, not a surprise with a fully controlled army, right? It's yeah, the three decas bag. So, so I'll just give you some perspective here. There, uh, yeah, no, no just worries. One. No. Shield moves, right? Preserving their shields, not rolling, not getting too aggressive. Yeah. Well, those B ones are in their like main lane that they want to roll out through. Yeah, and you know what? I, there's still a lot of bodies on the table for the, oh, for yeah. the drive. Oh, yeah. Even with the panic unit, which was just a naked B1 squad. Like, honestly, if anyone were going to panic, that would be the one to, that you were going to take out that was still going to be uh, right. still gonna be top of your bowl. Uh, just some questions coming in here from chat. Uh, Matt Kish in chat. Uh, question coming in here, guys, if you want to handle this one right here. Uh, there we okay. go. <laughs> Which <laughs> game are you playing? Hey, we're fair. Playing, we're, yeah, fair, hey, welcome. Uh, fair question, we're playing, exactly. We're playing a game called Star Wars Legion. It's a tabletop miniatures game. Um, it's a Star Wars game, and uh, it has it features four armies: the Empire and the Republic from the classic or original trilogy, and the new uh, Clone Wars uh, Confeder Confederates of Independent Systems. The Separatists, essentially, and then the Republic clones. And right now, um, we're seeing a game here of the Empire with an army led by Darth Vader playing against a droid army led by General Grievous. So kind of uh, fudging the timelines here. But, uh... Uh, he has to remove two here because endurance. Two here because endurance. That was a lot of discretion. I mean, I've got, I've got other predictions. I know that Cad Bane's hat has got to be in one of those boxes. Yeah, for sure. That's what's the real value here. <laughs> uh, all right, boys, I'm just bringing you uh, right back here to the command uh, deck for a second. Players are just picking up. Uh, they're just making sure they got all their tokens, all that good stuff. If I can just do a couple of the... Uh, the uh, shenanigan plugs, uh, which I always uh, like to do. So um, if you guys are interested at all in watching this and supporting the show, we have uh, we have our PayPal there. You guys can go check it out. It's Train Studio 2019 Gmail. It supports both the Train Studio Legion Academy as well as Friday Night Fights. Uh, so if you guys are inclined, there you go. If you want to check us out, we are Tuesday nights at 7.30 for Legion Academy podcast every Tuesday. Joe and I sit down and we often have guests and we do some ramblings about competitive things, new releases. We'll be talking the Gen Con uh, in-flight report. That'll definitely be this week as well as Echo and Fives for the ARC Troopers uh, with the drop of that article this week. So come check us out Tuesday. Like I said, we're there. If you guys are inclined, that's uh, the info again. And we do definitely appreciate this. Uh, the setup doesn't run itself, and we definitely want to reinvest in making this the best stream possible. So I'll let you guys recap turn one, and then when the guys are ready, I'll bring you guys back in. This? Yeah, no. So yeah, like oh, I was saying earlier, explosive turn for the Empire round one. Yes. Uh, Empire has definitely moved up. They uh, Vader got that center objective. The shores and the mortars and the dubaks also just laid down a whole ton of suppression. Although droids don't really care too much about suppression, yeah. except for the squad that did apparently, because they were just a little too far from from Grievous. And and we see that in the canon all the time. I mean, droids yeah. they do get scared and run away. It's I was actually just going to say that. Like, <laughs> yeah. do you think he'd hear us if we left? <laughs> yeah so a really really good starting position for the empire here but we'll see how things swing i mean general grievous is yet to get in and once he gets in he is very explosive so mm -hmm. we'll see if he can make some plays here coming into turn two yeah the big right. things are in the droid list today are general grievous and those three yeah, droidicas so and neither of them have really so hit the main center of the action yet so it's still it's still anybody's game uh, mm -hmm. The Empire just got an early shot in, but the uh, the droids have yet to fully move in and respond. But when they're when they when they do, it it could certainly turn. Yep. All right. Uh, if you guys are ready, they are ready, so I can bring you guys over. All right. All right. Turn two. Here we go. 
cards are ready and the flip happens. <gasps> Ooh. Ooh. Both oh, pips already. Yeah. Action, Jackson. Okay. Oh, show us, show us. Yeah. Oh, and it's Mike with the Mike. with the victory there again. Wow, okay, so he's going for the one. <laughs> yeah, if you guys see here too in the overhead, um, Grievous at the, that tail end, that last activation, he's he's down, he's staring down the mouth of that dewback. So this will be interesting. I don't know. Does he does he try to get to the backside of the dewback? Who knows? Jace is pretty spaced out, so it's a, it'll be interesting to see for sure. Blink tap on the uh, the back units there, so we coordinated a couple of ones. Yeah, hundred percent. Who are you going with first, Mike? I'm honestly really surprised. <laughs> see Grievous one pip at, at, at this point in the game, but we'll see. We'll see and here comes that Grievous bomb. Actually, see if you have the blast. Oh, but there we go. Honestly, oh. I, oh. Yeah, we just had a little bit of correction. Sorry, uh, Jeff. Jeff saying uh, th this particular overhead is losing the commentator's audio, but we have it now, so I should have that fixed up. There you go. It's good. Oh, okay. Yeah. Cool. Fair enough. Yeah. So I guess it's okay. We, we didn't just, say anything we were, important. We well, just, we were you, just debating. You, you might have. You might have before, but <laughs> yeah. yeah. Fair enough. Looks like he's going for the double move into the do back, going to engage it. Um, which is really good because it forces that do back to have to withdraw if it if it doesn't die, which means it's yep. effectively not going to do too much this turn. The only thing we were worried about is overextending so Grievous and overextending his command bubble and then having Dolls. more droids panic. Yeah, that's so. yeah. Essentially, we were just saying moving Grievous a little too far and making sure that the B ones aren't going to panic. But at the same time, maximizing Grievous's one pip is going to be uh, is going to be real important here. Yeah. So he might be trying to get it out earlier rather than later. Is he? Does he have range on Vader? Is that what I just saw? Check. I don't think so. I didn't think so either. It didn't look like have, it. But so four, four coming into the do back and Pierce two. Well, it's got armor. Yeah. Yeah, yeah we've got armor, but he's got impact. He's got impact. So. so. We might have previously uh, missed a few audio clips there, but I think people nobody else said, so I, I think you guys handled everything on the, on the recap quite nicely. I also just yeah. went and switched you guys up to give you a slightly different in-camera shot here so we can get a little bit more of that combat there. So, Ooh, Dubak takes four. So I think what happened there was And then the armor flipped one of them off, and he took all four wounds. One. All right, so I think we're starting to see uh, the, uh, the one pip, uh, one right. pip bomb here. Yep, and there's the crit into the do back that I'm seeing. Three. Uh, well, there's no pierce on this one. Three, three into the shores here. Uh, just gonna give you guys an overhead views. Ooh, just took out Vader with a headbutt. <laughs> Sick. Uh, Sick move. Sign him up to the rebellion. <laughs> Um, I think you have this guy from center to center, though. Oh, yeah, center to center on him. Yeah, so it is no cover. So three. Okay, got to roll. No cover. Three. Four, four, six, three saves on those shorts and three also suppressed. And, uh, and, and it's got all three. Blocks. Gross. Wow. That's one. Uh, they uh, Jason asked for a. There you go, Jason. I got that focus fix on the do back shot for you, sir. Sorry, I'm running back and forth between my seat and cameras, so there we go. Okay. Like I said, Sean is, uh, Sean is doing a million things at once, so... Uh, <laughs> trying to make sure you guys are not away. missing. He's certainly trying. Yeah. Yeah, so ultimately, man, I think, to be honest, after seeing that rollout, not the most effective Grievous one pick. No, but that'll happen. If I'm Jace, I'm feeling really good right now. I mean, he's yeah. basically saved his short troopers, you know? And you know what he just did was he just walked, uh, is he just walked Grievous right up into a uh, real easy Vader smite range. Yes. Although it looks like he is picking up those droids. Yes. He just moved them up there. 
Any so now they're going to have to come down from there. Uh, so you'll Makes sense. Able. I figured he might have been pulling Grievous away so that his dewback didn't have to withdraw. But no. interesting play as well. And then he's just going to start moving to engage Grievous. Or not. He's thinking. Yeah, I don't. This I don't is a bit. This is important. Yeah, he's Man, got an objective. I, I don't know if I'd do it. So Grievous is locked there. I would probably yeah. move in the opposite direction, to be honest. I don't know if I'm coming back. But hey, you know, I see the argument for both. He can't get the ranged attack. Maybe he's going to go for the force push, pull Grievous out. The rebel player in me is screaming, "Run right now!" Because <laughs> I'm, I'm like, if I have an objective, I'm leaving. That's uh, move mine. That, like, move that box too, Jace. Yeah, I will. It's going to show you guys where that new box position Getting will be. Getting all the way there. Yeah. Just reminding Jace that the box does follow Vader. Yeah, but... there we go. And that's where, that's where I end up there too, folks, so you guys know. If you guys want to know... Like, uh, it looks like he's yeah, made it. Now I will... Let's attack you. Yeah. Wow, okay. He's got there. Yeah. Now, remember... Grievous doesn't have a mutant pierce, but he does have impervious. Vader has pierce three, so he's going to add a few extra defense dice to his to his defense. So we're going to be saying eight defense dice here, seeing if we yeah. can block against what uh what Vader's throwing down. Uh, yeah, he needs. Yeah. Question here about uh, Vader's uh, or uh, Grievous's equipment. He has aggressive tactics, endurance, and esteemed leader. So he doesn't even have his blaster. Wow. Oh. Mm, that's and three blocks. And then I he's got three. three. Yeah. And does he have any surges? I think he's gonna take all five wounds. Oh my goodness. Yeah. So oh, Grievous. Grievous. Wow. This is that's, not a good turn for you, my that's man. That's not good. Yeah, I thought that was probably a little, a and little aggressive. For going for that and one bit. Sean, do we have time for two games tonight? <laughs> <laughs> It's uh, it is not looking good for Grievous and uh, yeah. the uh, the neighborhood of Mister Roger Roger here. Uh. But you know, the Droidicus, like I said, the Droidicus still haven't moved up yet. I mean do that that Dubak's just gonna aim punch, throw yeah, a bunch of dice, here. Grievous, right? It's like I think oh. I think Grievous moved a little too aggressively on this turn here. Yeah, like I get what he was going for. I, I totally get what he was going for, and with where I'm like, ooh, juicy one pick, turn two, yep. yep. And you just kind of, yeah, you overextend, and if you don't get a ton of value out of it, it's, it might be a death. Because I was even thinking when he first rushed in, I was like, well, he's got to do to draw and shoot him with his entire army. I didn't even think he needed to make the play with Vader, but oh, oh but it paid off. Yeah. Oh. Oh, what is this? A nasty this, short trip roll out of the like play? Shores? Uh, no, this is... Uh... Oh, is that an E5 squad? Yeah, yeah, oh, that was, that yeah, was the E5Cs right. on the backside on shore troopers there, so... Okay. Okay. Nifty. And looks like uh, three oh, chase rolled three blocks, yeah. The, the, the Empire doesn't even need these good right? guys. Six for six. Yeah. Six for six. Shore troopers are not giving up. Yeah, wow. Four. I'm gonna go with these shores. Alright, so he's gonna go those backside shores, the ones that just got shot there. They're gonna have to rally. Yeah. They're gonna rally uh, one off. Which yep. leaves them with two. So they're not oh, gonna panic, sorry. but they will get one action. Yeah. Um, we're gonna grab it. <laughs> grab okay. that object? Good idea. Yeah. Box grab right there, so that is. I'll just get rid of those. You guys can. Oops, there it is. That's the one that we're talking about right there. Yep. All right, so Mike pulled Droidicas. Not sure which ones he's going. Still got a lot of wounds and firepower left in those Droidicas, so. Right. Yeah. There's Droidicas. Could change yeah. the game if they get in there and start and, weighing them yeah. down. And they are yeah. coming up in a wave. It's going to make it really hard to be grabbing boxes, but it could make a lot of other things drop boxes. So, <sighs> Yeah, I mean, it's, as long as Vader's alive, 
surrounding that whole army, though, nothing's panicking. So That's exactly what I was going to say. Is, man, yeah, these, these droidicas would be doing a whole ton more work right now if Vader wasn't alive. Right. But Vader's still there making sure that that infinite... Oh, yeah. see a camera. Yeah, Jace, Jace is just going to keep Vader there or surround his entire army and be like, you're going to have to kill him or you're not going to win. Right, right. and... Maybe I, I, I don't think Grievous did a good start on uh, on putting putting Vader down. I feel like Grievous would have been the first first weapon to take down Vader with, but he's uh he elected to go for the bomb and uh, didn't really uh, didn't really pay off this time. Yeah, Droidicas did put another. Two yeah, so it looks like they have three on those, or did four, you? Four, oh, four of them. Okay, yeah, four four suppression on those back shore troopers. So. No, not running, but it is going to maybe potentially have to keep Vader in this bubble, right? So Yes. yes. All right, maybe, so we got a core got a unit core. pulled. Yeah, core pulled. Mm. Absolutely loving uh, interaction with chat tonight, guys. That's fantastic. So keep it up. Keep out your questions or whatever, or your cheers, or your jeers, or your banter, or whatever. <laughs> 166 on the thumbs up tonight. So shade. Appreciate that. <laughs> fair enough. Fair enough. We saw some early shade. Oh, man. Yeah. So looks like the mortar is actually still in range to shoot those B1s that are tucked behind that crescent. Yeah. Oh, yeah. oh and I'll tell you oh, what. Is. With, with Grievous being so hyper extended towards that dewback, I that's not a good spot to be in if you're those three one. They're probably they're probably not even in range three right now. Yeah, I, I don't would, think they, I would has I think they, they are. Remember yeah, you know, when you were joking and saying this game was gonna be over in forty five minutes? I mean that's, the, that's, that's arguably looking more uh, looking more yeah. and more possible right now. If we were to just quickly throw up the uh, deployment yep. zone for tonight that mm -hmm. right there might give us a little bit of an indication so of just how far Grievous is out so I'm going to guess that he is probably more close to four than he is to three yeah I would say so yeah yeah yep. yep. Oh, man. so yeah I think you just pepper those B1 it's like pick a B1 squad and suppress them every turn yep yeah, that's, that's basically more what basically all yeah, you have to do now. Yeah. You yeah. Uh, uh, looks like we got nothing coming in there. What was that that fired? Uh, that was the B ones on top of that. Yeah, uh, naked uh, ones. Yeah, on top of the uh, steps there. Okay. Um, excuse me. Yeah. <laughs> it's like going. Yeah. Excuse me. Come back. Here. <laughs> Go, going for a shot first, and then they got to move. So he's gonna just move them down. Okay. Hopefully that could uh, prevent them from soaking more fire from those shore troopers. But we'll see. I think the shore troopers are in really good position to just grab that box, extract it, hide. The Empire has a fantastic setup they're, right now. They're in a really good position. Yeah. Yeah. All right, so we got a support token pulled. Yeah, so we got a do back. Let's do back. Mm -hmm. And they're just going to waltz up and delete this B1 squad, probably. Yeah, that's that's what I'm guessing. I What's mean, up, guys? That's a why, nice box. Why not? <laughs> yeah. I'm going to aim, and then, and then I'm going to get speed two. Now, they can't, they can't claim it, right? No. No. Yeah, yeah, I think so. Yeah, they can just deny cannot. it. Yeah. I guess. Yes. Deny. But here's the thing. What else is going to go pick it up? Right. That's what I'm but, saying. It's yeah. like this other B1 squad that's about to panic off the board. Right. Right. Yeah. Right. Although if I'm if I'm Mike, I'm I'm considering taking one of my short troopers that are going to grab that box on the store on the stairs there and running them all the way down to grab that other box because nothing's going to stop him. Got a nice roll out of yeah. four. Brutal there. Five, 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 five of them. That's probably Yikes. enough to wipe them. Yikes! It's probably the squad. Yeah, let's see what happens here. Right, let's see that hot B one or B one defense roll. Oh, oh. No, right. oh, not enough. That's a classic one droid defense roll. Yep. All right. So really, that that really hurt. That really. 
Um, and man, that Dubak's just there to spur again and charge those other droids. There's a, uh, potentially new ways to motivate them on the table if if he wants it. I don't even know if it's necessary. Yeah. But, oh. Yeah, this game quickly fell apart for the droids. Uh, yeah. I, I, I don't even know how he's going to recover from it. But, you know, anything's possible. I always tell that to The way to recover is to hopefully keep Grievous alive. I don't think it's going to happen. Yeah, it's, uh, it's unlikely, but mm. give everything give everything a chance. Let's see these Jordicas lay into this lone short trooper here, because I think that's all they can see is just that one. But he's the box carrier. Double oh, he's move. double moving. Okay. Did he not have range? Must not have had range. No, he did. He did, but he didn't shoot. I'm, I'm confused. Just at four. Okay. I don't know what he, I, I would have shot. That would have, that would have uh, tied those he, short troopers down there for he, another turn. He did not have range there. Oh, okay. I thought he said he did. My bad. Okay. Yeah, I was thinking I was going to be rooting for the Empire because of that mortar guy up on the tower, and then now now I'm kind of wanting to see the droids underdog get real bad, but it's going to be yeah. tough. Down two activations. Sean, if you wouldn't mind. Yeah, uh, uh, I'm going to do that right now. Mike, that squad that got wiped out on the back, Which what did they have in them? Uh, gray that was naked, just naked. Gray, so both naked ones so are both fully. Naked squads, yeah. yeah. So that, the least the least done. effective things uh, to work like the 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 weakest units you know you don't need to worry about losing naked B ones but yep. being down two activations is definitely it can it can really spiral quickly from there so especially those it, activations that were near the objective yeah that's the big thing is that those were the only guys that were really there to grab that box. Your other guys now have to go through a do back at if if they even survive. Yeah. So, man, I almost think those droidicas probably instead of double moving should have went for a speed three move and a dodge. Maybe just go, yeah, just, just go slower. Just so they set up already. Yeah. Yeah. So it looks yeah, mortar just feeding suppression to something. Yeah, suppression uh, in the middle lot on that middle unit. Middle. Yeah, just really and man. Oof. We could see a turn. I, I don't know what I don't know what's coming from Vader in turn three, but I'm assuming turn four could be uh, potentially a, uh, the suppression bomb. Which one are you going with? Really, just punish. We'll have to see. It's possible, yeah. That's that very well could be. Rallying. He's going for the unit uh, right behind the uh, right behind the. Uh... Are they panicking? No, no, yeah. no. Oh yeah, sorry. They are panicking. Yeah, they look like they are. Yeah. yeah, they panicked. They took three suppression. They're out of grievous. But they're not. But they're not off the board. One. Correct. No, you, you made two. You made two so far. Yeah. Because you rolled two blocks. No surges. Yeah. Two blocks. Not Zero rolling surges. well for suppression, Mike. Mike lamenting his suppression not roll off rolls. Yeah, there. and you know what, Mike's man? Mike's not rolling anything. You know what? Here's the thing. That dewback's just just gonna eat him up next yeah. turn. I do. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he's loving that. He's like, "Oh, you just moved closer," you know. Uh, right. Yeah. Uh, Chad, could... Oh, uh, sorry. I just answered your question. So it is just live to Facebook for the live shows, and then we'll do a post game upload to uh, YouTube following uh, following the live stream. So uh, I gotta try to rally first. Right. All right. Jay's going for a rally here. No rally there. Really? Yeah, so it looks like he's going to have one action. He's just going to take the shot at the B1s. Yeah, I just well. pump, pump a bunch of... Uh, yeah, just, keep, uh, just yeah. Keep, keep putting it on. And he's got full range three, so he's throwing all the dice. Oh, we got no dice cam. Yeah. Oh, sorry, my bad. I uh, just turned it off so you guys didn't see any arms, but uh, there you go. Woo! All right, so crits. two crits and a hit after cover. Uh, so I get the two. And we got nothing. No saves. Oh, man. And one more suppression. Just want to sweep, Very dice, sad. sweep dice for me there. Thanks. There you go. Thank you. Good 
Ugh. B1s are just exploding left and right. They're just popping. Yeah, the, I don't know if that dewback has enough room on the stairs there or to like go around the stairs to to really make it to do another charge, but they didn't even need to. They can just sit behind it, block them, and do T1, T21 shots and just take them out. Yeah. If they don't panic next turn and just leave on their own. So I really don't know. I really don't think there's any way for the droids to come back and, and grab that objective. Yeah. Um. Droidicas are moving. Yep, Droidicas is going to get a move on here. Man, I, I'm i just not sold on Droidicas. I love the model, but I, I just don't know if I love what they do for their points. Yeah, I mean, they're they're not too expensive. If they were more even more expensive, I'd, I'd agree. But I think even where they're at right now, I think, I think that just like everything in Legion, there's a place for it, and... We just need to figure out like how many and where and what the niche is for running them. I feel like I feel like they would be they could be really fun in uh, what is it the uh, bombing run if you just like speed three roll them on down the side. Yeah, but, yeah, they could be. But yeah. why not just take an AAT? Yeah, and and like so an AAT would have shot four times already in this game and three droidicas have literally done nothing in two turns well if they rolled if they if they if they uh, rolled a little this, faster right, instead of sure. double moving each turn that's usually what i see some people play droidicas and then they spend their first three turns double moving and i'm like if you just rolled on the first turn or something and you weren't going to get shot at you're that's you're 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 speeding up a lot quicker that's and the big assumption you you're not going to get shot at because if i see a droidica that has no true. shields i'm just like oh that's a juicy kill Depends on where they're at. Usually, yeah. if they're like mid backfield or something, and there's not, a, and they're like behind line of sight, I'm just like, why aren't you? Yeah. Like, you might as well yeah. roll them. Like behind that, I don't know how high that cliff is. But I guess Grievous got shot over, so I suppose they could too. Yeah. What do you What do you wonder about Ben? Which uh, does that Does that help you out? Just kind of back see that, that. Yeah, yeah, a little bit. It was that back cliff. I was wondering, like it's, maybe if the balls the, were going to be below at the highest below that point. Line, but maybe not. Yeah, at the highest point, it's it's uh, just uh, model height. So Grievous is probably over that in in all uh, in all uh, shots. So they pop out their shields and everything. So it's not like it's like a short short trooper took a shot at a, the droidicas and did a wound. Yeah. All right. So where are we going? These other droidicas, or is this the B1 squad back here? Looks like B1s. Yep. Okay, core token confirms it. B1s are starting to roll down toward the south to support the uh, to support the mess that's going on down there that that dewbacks caught and the mortars are causing. Yeah. Yeah. Those guys right there. So I guess those those droidicas are probably set up to try to suppress that dewback out. Maybe he's gonna come in and take shots with the B ones, but man, I don't know. That could be, but I feel like the, I feel like the Droidicas aren't in range where they're at right now. And if I was the Dewback no. and I was a little worried about those uh, about those do or about those Droidicas coming in, I would just sit there and take T twenty one shots with those droids, and I don't even have to move. True, honestly. Mm, big dice roll. Yeah. Was yeah. well, that going into oh, Grievous? Is that a Dewback punching Grievous? I think that was a Dewback into Grievous there. Oh, yeah. Kind of looks like yeah. it. Oh man, Grievous could be done here. Yep. Yeah, I think he is. Oh, that's a lot of two, no surge yet. Grievous on eight. Yeah. Don's go. Done. That's it. Man, and that's why you need aggressive tactics. No. He he does have aggressive well, he, tactics. He has aggressive tactics on him. Did he did he, he not have a surge? surge? I think he might have used it on his attack. He used it on his attack. Yeah. Ah. Uh, oh. <laughs> I mean, which would we have? Which which right which would have been yeah, good? And this attack would have never happened. So I'm I'm. It's really easy to go back in hindsight and say that's not the place to spend it. But I think Mike was trying to punch through, and he did get four through. Would have probably liked to punch another one, plus his end around shot. So I think that Dubak should have been dead. So I think that play was actually good, but it just didn't pan out on the dice results. So sadly, that seems to be the droid's theme right now. Is they they have the best well laid plans, and then uh, and then they're just not coming through. Yeah. So, so also. So did Grievous have his dodge from his one bit? 
Uh, did you have your uh, dodge from your one pip and spend it on the Vader attack, or? Uh, no. Okay, so he. Uh -oh. Just yeah, he he he'd he'd, he'd still be dead, but just yes, he did forget yeah. there. So yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. All right, I'm jumping Probably back to the jump, too much, jumping back to the booth there, guys. While they clean up so and go into that was round two concluded there. So um, let me just address a couple things in chat here. Uh, people calling for a game two. Uh, although that would be super fantastic, it actually takes a ton of setup work to get ready for this and, and preload everything. So. I wouldn't be able to flip it over that quick. Um, we will do some double headers. Joe and I were talking last night. We'll probably try to shoot maybe once every five weeks or so, and we'll do a double header skirmish night. It's a little bit easier to run that, and we can actually run two games simultaneously for skirmish, and so we can kind of bring you guys dual action at the same time, but unfortunately I could not uh, run a second game here tonight. Not because I wouldn't want to, just because it's a little bit too much setup on my end, so yeah. Fair enough. Fair. Yeah, go ahead. Well, enough. go ahead and recap that, and these guys will do their command cards. Yeah, and... just just another devastating turn for the Empire, just dominating the CIS. Uh, Grievous dead. Uh, we got a B1 squad dead. Uh, really, not a bad spot, or not a great spot for the uh, for the droids. I mean, they they're forced to nominate a B1 unit as a commander, so they only have a Courage One bubble now. They have no more Courage. Uh, their leader is dead, man. Then and he died too early. He died before he could do anything. So that really hurts. Yeah, that is one of the the fastest ways I've seen Grievous crash and burn. Was just yeah. he dove right in, trying to get trying to get an early cut in on the dewback and the shores and the mortar, possibly even Vader. But I don't think he had range. But yeah, it just it didn't pan out. And that's I've seen I've seen it happen with uh, yeah. with Grievous players. Yeah, they'll jump in and they'll try and do that bomb real it's real a, early. It, and... It's a classic over aggressive Grievous play too early. Sadly, and, yeah, it is. And and you know I'm, if this was a double the fall list, I'd say that might have been worth it. But in when you just have just Grievous on the table as your commander, I think you right. have to play a little more conservatively Agreed. and hold him hold him for like turn three or four. But we'll see. We'll see. The game's not over. You know, it's still a game of objectives. Yeah. Although the objectives are really favoring the Empire right yeah. now, we'll, we'll have to see. Jace can easily do a, a walk on this, just a walk down the board and take two objectives with one short trooper unit. Yeah, Let's... and I know this. I know this isn't the most fun, but if I'm Jace, I just kind of turtle up behind all the line of sight blockers and just win at this point. Yeah, that's the uh, that's the smart move. Go ahead, throw that do back into something, whatever. It's there to just <laughs> cause a disruption and. Take all your shore troopers and Vader and just pop back behind all those those structures and just win. Have them come to you, yeah. And make the Droidicus chase you and then just kill them. You know. Uh, just just pointing out here to you guys, just so you guys know, uh, there's the four objectives there. The spinny one here at the bottom, just to denote that that is actually not claimed. That was dropped by the B ones. Who uh, okay. who fell off and uh, and so that one is going to be probably tough to get to, but mm -hmm. uh, there is a B one squad here kind of tucked down at the bottom. So depending on what they can do with that uh, that do back or what the do back can do to them rather, there is some joy. There is, some droid about to make a sandwich there is there is some droidicas well, here just just off to the you know to the kind of like the northeast here which could come down and lend a little bit of support. Um, so maybe not a foregone conclusion. And there also is those couple B ones that are likely due to panic, which will panic in the right direction. So there's uh Okay, I guess they're just uh, so, doing a little swap so here, there. So here's what I'm thinking. That Dubak is not in Vader's command bubble range it, by this it point. Is, it Vader is not. Moved, uh, That's correct. So he's got a so those Droidicas and those B ones, if he if he dedicates everything to pumping all the suppression into that Dubak before he gets pulled <laughs> I think there's a possibility that that dewback might panic off the board. Right. Yeah. That okay. Could very well happen. And, that's and, that's totally something that could happen. Right. It could. And even if it does, though, I mean, I don't think Jace cares. I think that's he's just. Well, then the droids have a. Yeah. yeah I, I agree, but I think the droids then have an opportunity to actually pick up that box again. All right. Yeah. It's, could. It's it's like a hopeless form right now, but it, it, there's a shot. There's still awesome. a shot. Okay, I'm going to throw it over to turn three. Turn three screens up. We'll go over to the player window here, and uh, let's see the cards from the players. The armor one is just so good. Here's the flip. 
Do I got uh, push, push and new ways to motivate. Hey, we are really good at rolling the uh, initiative dice here tonight. Mike has won all three Let me see, so Mike. Oh, there it is, yeah, Mike. Yeah, I was say, is it going to be Mike? <laughs> Mike takes it, so... I mean, Mike's, Mike's, only Mike's rolling. To win the, uh, priority. Yeah. The only Mike, and then Mike rolls. Just, uh, Mike roll all the blocks. Back. That's that's where all the grievous blocks went right there. <laughs> <Yep>. <laughs> They're all going into go, going first. Yeah. All right. So Mike is. Although what's here, that's he, important. What's he doing here? I'm just gonna. I gave you guys a little bit of a wider angle here on this action cam, just to kind of get a bit more perspective of what's going on. I will say I'm uh, I'm getting a good workout here tonight, running back and forth and switching cams. So good. Keep that cardio up. Yeah. All right. Looks like Jace has actually got. Uh, he's gonna go with this do back here, the one that erased Grievous. So you probably move that this way. Uh, like that. We're just pressing. Yeah. Or is the deck is out. Get a side pressure. Yeah. So I'm saying. If he, if he dedicates everything on the south side of the board to taking out that two back, I, there, there's maybe a play to grab that box again. But he's got to act yeah, on it fast, and it, and he might be going for the shot on the shores up up here, like we were thinking he was going to do last turn too. And honestly, either of those are not a bad move to uh to start with. I think. Here he goes. It looks like yeah, looks like he's going for Dead. that, and it looks like he's gonna take out some shores. Definitely gonna have range this time for sure. Yep. Mm -hmm. I would hope. Yeah. Yeah. Two guys there, visible. The big one's the box carrier. That's the one I need to get. Yeah, and I mean, you can't see the whole squad, so they could potentially drop the box carrier on a good yep. roll. <laughs> uh, they don't oh, surge, I don't think. No. So. Two crits. Yeah. Uh, Jace does lose one. Okay, and just a suppression count on them. They're at five, five suppression on those uh, those short troopers there. But they're but they're staying. Yeah, what they, it, they what are, does it matter? They <laughs> are, yeah. But they're gonna be fine. Wait, oh, oh, they are rallying. Yeah, right. yeah, they they. they that would have been a panic right there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> on, on another commander. Here's the thing. I'm just saying, like. You know, there is potential, like I said, those droidicas get in position. It is turn three. There's still a lot of game, and and if they are in range for the remainder wait, wait, of the Jace game. Wait, wait, Jace just did two actions. Hey, hey, oh, they got just, to just, just, one move. Jude. New ways to motivate them? Oh, he, take a wound. Yeah, oh, yeah, he took a, took a wound. Oh, right. Disgusting. Yeah. Tricking yeah. everybody today. Yeah. New ways to motivate them. My yeah. bad. Yep. Took a wound, so they're down to two there. And then they double move. That one got by me, too. Well yeah. played. Well played. Yeah. Uh, now those Droidicas can't do anything. Nope. Oh, oh, that was so good, jeez. <laughs> Woo. Yeah, he's gonna erase this dude back, I think, right now. No, this dude back. Oh, I think. I, I, yeah. Have to, because. Yeah, yeah, I guess. He's just gonna, yeah. Steam shoot at it. And... I don't know, it's gonna roll around the corner. I feel like you could take it with your whole north side of your board there. Here it comes. That's not that much luck. Not fantastic. Yep, armor takes care of one and lives. Yikes. What, did, ooh, what was your uh, second action there? Oh, okay. That was AI. Oh, oh it's AI because he didn't have a. Yeah, gotcha. So second yeah, action is going to be to move up here. Okay. No. That's where we're at. Okay. Well, I think those shores could just chew those guys apart if they want. Yeah, now they got a free shot. Mm-hmm. Still got all kinds of shields. Shield. Bader can kind of do whatever he wants at this point, but I'm kind of curious where he will go. Because uh, uh, Jace, Jace is playing him super aggressively. <laughs> I don't know yeah. what he rolled there, so. <laughs> Jace is getting a little excited here, so. I think it was one surge there. One surge. Oh, I'm, so he's got, so he's doing the do back and they're, what is he going to do? Is he going to roll around the corner and just like slow everybody down from coming at him? Not sure. He's making, making a uh, okay, case. So Vader's taking a wound. Or do back. Sorry. He's taking a wound. That's what I meant to say. Taking a name. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Then reposition. 
Oh, they're going. He's going down to answer. Yeah. yeah. Delete these B1s real quick. Oh. No, he's going to hit them. Oh. Nope. Just go for wow. it. Right, cause... Wow. Hey, guys. What's up? And notably, they can't spend their shield tokens on a melee attack. No, that's right. No. Very likely that they're going to get cut in half here. See, that spear just drives straight through that shield, and bam, that's probably going to take one. Three, four, I think? Yeah, that's, that's going to take a droid to go. Probably, on that probably a droid to go. Nope. Yep. So Mike's got a spikes and dice here. Continue making this. You may. So one, one, one save and loses a droid, I guess. Yeah, there it goes. Oh, I Ugh. Two Disgusting. There are two more suppression plates. And suppressing up that do back, although it really, really does matter at this it's point. A, it's, it, yeah. <laughs> They're just there to be annoying. Mm -hmm. Yeah. They're good at it. Yep. Vader, do X, man. That's, hey, that's the it. way to play do backs. I think arguably the only way to play do backs right now. And Jace yeah, definitely yeah. putting on a clinic. Joe, maybe you can yeah. uh, maybe you can respond to this. It's uh, I mean, they have Robert in up, chat up. saying, I like Droidicas, but I'll also have a hard team. time. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah, I like Droidicas, but also have a hard time to kill at least 101 plus enemy points, especially oh, against MSU type lists. Yeah. If they don't kill over so unit I'm costs, then it's hard to game. want to take them. And I 100% agree. I yeah. I literally, there's, to me, there is literally no reason to take them over an A18 or double the fall. Like, yeah, there's just, sport, just right? not, yeah. not yeah, considered yeah, a ground vehicle, vehicle right? Yeah, yeah. Because they're ground vehicle. And yeah. I think no, stabs, stabs too. Like, once stabs come out, you're just going to take stabs. Like, probably, yeah. yeah like, it's just, they're too, they're too expensive for what they do. They don't surge. They don't have critical. So they're just, they're just oh, really expensive. Just Oh, Ooh. do back, do back down. That one's back dead. Do back yeah. dead. dead. It's okay. Just he barely. Yeah, he he did work though. So yeah. Yeah. Now that totally got his points. No, oh, no, yeah. Notably, that that droidic is still pretty healthy with four shields left alone on that single. So. Right. Short of a do back ration, ration, racing in on it's yeah. probably gonna be okay. The shots coming and might take in yeah. a second, second. Uh, back. Second action that, that attrition hurts it though. It's basically it a suppression shot. Yeah, exactly. Point, but mm -hmm. Again, oh, Vader army though. So. Mm -hmm. Well, I mean, didn't we just not have this conversation about about Op Vader versus Commander Vader? Yeah, and yeah. how we just absolutely that that I don't care about suppression is amazing. Yep. All That's right, so yeah, Jason. Definitely making hairs. a difference with the uh, with like Droidica's suppressive fire and everything. Yep. Yep. Jace doing some measuring here. Yeah, it's uh, that's a clever tactic. I'm not sure if you guys caught that, but Jace separated his ruler so you get a little extra range on the uh, on the range ruler there. So. <laughs> <laughs> See how many events that'll fly at. Yeah. <laughs> Let me, just ex <laughs> let me just extend this a little bit here. That's yeah. That's called the power <laughs> move. Yeah. Jay's gonna take a shot at that droid, I believe. Yeah. Start whittling him down. You got oh, the shots. Uh, you got the time. Why not? Yeah. It looks Ritz, like we got five here so far. Are you even gonna get a shield? You may as well. Take yeah. Four shields, four shields four down. down. Yeah. Need one more to potentially kill uh, And Mike obliges with a blank. One more wound on the droid. One more wound on the droidica until it goes down. Yeah, and no shields, so I basically just pop it with anything at this point, and it's done. Have all those mortars gone yet? Those uh, mortars could pop I it. I do the, not think so. I don't think either mortar, like on top, or I don't think any mortars gone this round. No, no mortars. Yeah, not yet. <sighs> yeah, let's get this. Let's get this guy who's up on the tower a name, and get him to bomb that droidica and rank I, up. I think I've seen Ringo <laughs> called a couple times in uh, in chat Ringo. here. Yeah, for, Ringo. Uh, yeah, well, I don't get the it. reference, but fair enough. Ring <laughs> Ringo Star? <laughs> uh, maybe I'm not sure. Yeah, just shooting Vader. Oh, I, I will say Mike's droids are looking pretty good down here and quite healthy at this end. So 
It's uh, you catch the plague if you go forward, so. <laughs> and they're just gonna pop shots in the Vader. Uh, sorry, I'll pop that back up. Just trying to avoid seeing arm hair. Got three. Bam. Ooh, Vader takes Ow. three. Yep. Ooh. I like it. Mike. Mike already had the three spot wound token yeah, ready. Just, <laughs> oh my gosh. just, just, just throw this on real. Just throw this real on real quick, like, bro. Yeah. Gosh, that's such a that's such a move. It's that's, just that's like, a, hey, I'm just gonna hand this to you, and uh, you'll need it. That's a that's a typical Friday night fight move right there for sure. So, yikes. Yeah. <laughs> oh no, this other mortar's gonna take the shot. What about Ringo? Oh, he plants. Uh, taking the aim here. Nothing. No, save. Oh. That's uh, Ringo's shot. Don't try to steal it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Mike sensing the comeback here. <laughs> comeback begins. Yes, he pulls the he pulls the commander droids. Yep. <laughs> oh, definitely got range. Probably take definitely the got aim range shot or yeah. Uh, well, he pulled him, well so no he AI, AI AI attack. So oh, yeah. you got an AI attack there, Mike? Or oh, he's no, he's not. Oh, in they're not range. range. No, oh, well, they okay. got a move shoot. Fair enough. Yeah. Well, all right. Well, move shoot it is then. I mean, Mike's okay with that, I guess. He was, he was going to take the shot, shot anyway. So, yeah. Shots. Yes. All right. Really liking the uh, action shots, and I'm glad we added this extra cam, so I'm, I'm able to to see. Well, I don't have to get out of my seat so many times. So, all right. So there's the there's the angle. There's the angle coming in there at Vader. So yeah, there we go. What if the dice just crapped out on? Not the uh -oh. dice cam. You need. There you go. <laughs> Something like that. Uh, what was that, Mike? Okay, three hits coming in. Oh, he rolled the wrong dice. Yeah, fair enough. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay, so three dice coming in. Vader like takes. One more wound on Vader. One okay. Wound. Yep. Four. Yep. All right. Whew. I mean, I don't know. I'm not sure what Mike's got in terms of it can make the turn around the corner, but I mean, he does have two droidicas. I mm. doubt they can. Uh, maybe that front one, but they've already gone, actually. They shot the shore, so. But. Ringo! Here we go. Is this going to be the shot that kills Hey, will you let. One. There's the crit. Yeah, two crit. Oh no, one crit. Oh. It's, only, it's only crit. It's hey. only crit one. Sorry. Nope. Yeah. It's down. Down goes. Down goes. Uh, nice. Frazier. Yeah. And the Ringo, my man, piling up here. Just, just disgusting. Yeah. Sean, will you let Jace know that 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 mortar is named Ringo and he deserves a promotion? Uh, yeah, we'll do here. I'm just gonna go. Uh, <laughs> while while I'm doing that, I'm just gonna go erase another activation here. Mike down a droidica, fair enough. No, it's okay. There we go. We're good. No rally. So no rally there. That we're talking about the guys behind the stairs here so for they Mike. Gotta, they're gonna panic. Yeah. Yeah. For the board. Like edge, I, but like, but like I said, they're panicking in the right direction. If like, if they're able to kind of shake off this and do let's say Where that do back, something happens to that do back. Mike's got to have He's units to down there Vader. anyway. Where is it? Yeah. <laughs> All right. Oh, uh, the dewback. Probably going to charge these droids, I'm guessing. Yeah. He's taking a, taking a spur here. And the stormtrooper just kicking this dewback in the ribs, saying, get a move on. Yeah. There's the first one. Yeah. Looks like he's heading over. Get spurred oh, right over those. There you go. Yeah. You guys can see in the top corner, that's probably not the best angle there. Go back to that one. There he is, the big lizard. Yeah. There he is. Oh, I guess I guess he was able to go over the stairs. Yeah, I think uh, unhindered there, right? So and he's, and he's taller than those. So. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Just, yeah, creature just, troopers. Don't just care. jump, just yeah, jump right over that. So. Yeah, he's got critical there. So four into those. How many guys left in that squad, Mike? Is that a six-man squad or? There is seven. Seven man. Okay. Um, they get seven. Yeah. All right. Yep. So was full squad and four, four wounds. Not anymore. Yeah. No. Sorry, it was a full squad. Yeah, three man yeah. squad now. Out is down. And this dewback just gonna eat the rest of these droids for lunch. I'm guessing next turn he just 
swings again, kills the rest of the droids, spurs into the other droid, locks him in place. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Cool. Yeah. Pretty easy at this point. All right, what are these droidicas going to go? They're going to go around the building? I am not sure. We're going to have a look at that to see what's happening here. I'd honestly roll him if I were them at this point. Just roll him up to that yeah, tower. Totally, totally. Yeah. Looks like he yeah, might. Yeah, looks like he's what he's doing. Looks like he might do that. Yeah. Oh, casualty. Oh, crap. He's dead now, right? There goes one droidica. <laughs> yeah, loses Top all his right shields for that. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, he doesn't Man. have shields technically right now, so... Man, the amount of times I've broken a, uh, a droid or droidica in the middle of a game is too many to count. Uh, I actually, when I go to, when I go to primes or, or rally points or anything, I guess primes now, I bring like eight extra B ones. I've uh, broken not just the glue. Well, yeah, I do bring the glue as well, but I've broken them mid game, pretty much at every tournament I've ever played. Uh, Robert, just for you, uh, that uh, that twirling uh, objective marker there, that's also denoting the nominated commander squad. Yep, yep. just some B1s that are uh, yeah. very scared right now. Yep. Although they're the bravest ones right now because they just crested over the hill and shot at Vader. Yep. Uh, nothing there. Aim shot coming in. Uh, looks like... Two, so one crit. coming through. One yeah, crit. Yeah. Mike's got a spike a block here. Does not. We'll loses five another five suppression Man, there. Five yeah. suppression. Ouch. No, I'm sure he's fine. <laughs> All right. All right. So who do we have left? Where are these? Is it the B ones that are in melee with him? Uh, I think he's got shores on the backside of the. Uh... Oh, this is okay. Yeah. I, I thought this was droids for some reason. No, this is Mike. Derp. They're just pulling back. Because uh, I think Mike was out there, so yeah, Jace, no. Jace went twice. Yeah. Okay. Awesome. Well. You guys will awesome. be real. You guys will be real pleased with the reactions uh, at the end of the stream here. So, so uh, <laughs> lots of lots of a million shit. wows. Yeah, there's there's been a lot. It's, it's awesome. All all these help us out, guys, a lot. So hey, I should say this too. I forgot to mention before. If you guys haven't, if you guys want to go sub the uh, the Legion Academy YouTube uh, channel, this is where all these uh, bat reps will be found later. So if you're you know, uh, only tuning in now and you missed the start or vice versa, you can guys can go in there probably in the next day or so. This will be up there, but there will be previous ones as well as all the Legion Academy uh, live stream podcasts. So um, it's it's free to sub. So, hey, I mean, it just takes a couple clicks of a button and we really appreciate that. While you're there, yeah. you can also check out the two episodes of Dice Time that are now up and loaded. We'll be eagerly well, awaiting the third you. one. So That's a go good check show. that out. Oh, nasty crit yeah, roll here. Yeah, crit roll. Double crit. Mm, double blank. Double blank as usual. Yeah, I mean that's the that's the typical loadout. Did you basically with the droids? Did you just take those on your droidic no shields? He wheel mode it. Oh wheel mode it's correct. Sorry, I forgot. I forgot that because the shields yeah. Usually I slide the shields out. Yeah, yeah, notably droids there. who are in wheel mode have heavy cover, but guess what doesn't care about cover? Crits. Yep. So went right that's, through it. That's yeah. Uh, nice little uh, comment here coming in from uh, Sylvia. See, oh, don't mind if I do, but the live stream is pretty damn nice too. I appreciate nice. the Thank the you. rhyme of the of the comment as well. Has not gone lost. Has not been lost on me. Mm -hmm. yeah. All right. Thanks, so, man. Jace uh, trying to uh, find Vader in his bag here. <laughs> he's the last one. Yes. <laughs> I was going to say he's got to be the last one at this point. He's yeah, like, he, did did Elf has? Did Alpaz walk by and pocket that token? Yeah. I know he's oh, been... no. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Alpaz! <laughs> uh, uh, not to be forgotten, Bob Swain in, in uh, comments, uh, who does dice time with Ben, so of course, uh, shouts to Bob as well. All right. He's in and out because it's past his bedtime. He's Fair enough. <laughs> yeah, I know Jace's mom's probably going to give me a shout here to get him home, so... <laughs> It's like Vader going for the saber throw. I think he did, but I think it just went into uh, eight eight by cover. So yeah, yeah. Uh, cover two, nothing, nothing there. So yeah, cover on that. Yeah. 
Uh, yeah. So he's got the box. All right, so I'll send you guys back to the booth. There you go. All right. Yeah, well, again, another just punishing turn for the CIS. Losing a Droidica, losing a B1 squad. No casualties, really, on the Empire side. Well, Joe, I don't yeah. know how the droids come back from this one. I don't think they do. I, 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 I honestly don't think they do either. I keep waiting for that great underdog play, but... You gotta go for the moral victory at this point and just kill Vader for the fun Probably. Probably. See, well, that's what I would do. So we'll I was gonna to... say, if Vader died before he pulled him out of the bag somehow, if he somehow laid all the shots and Vader just blanked all the saves like he did on that first volley, we might be looking at a different game, but I don't think that's happening here. Right, right, yeah. Unfortunately, that was not the case, so... Mm. Let, me just, let me just recap all the uh, objectives for everyone here in chat. Uh, so this one is now, oops, sorry, this one is now shifted up there to the command units. Uh, we got this one who vacated back here on the uh, new ways to motivate move there. Um, we have this one sitting there. Uh, is that one unclaimed still on the steps? This, this one? Uh, yes. Yes. Okay, still unclaimed there. Roger that. <laughs> yep. And then uh, this one's yeah. un unclaimed hey, I, down I don't here, think so. Jace is too worried about it. No. I think he can, he's got plenty of time to pick that box up. Yeah, no, I just I wanted he's to make just sure. le leveraging his firepower at this point. We're ready mm -hmm. whatever they are, Sean. Just want to make sure. Uh, you guys all yeah. ready for uh, turn four? I can give the uh, turn counter over. Let's do it. Let's, Let's do, do it. it. Yeah. Okay. So turn four on the screen, and then we'll go to the cards momentarily. Here they are. Let's see the flip. Oh, and I'll just uh, dice that up. There we go. Uh, Fear and Dead Men, followed by whatever that is, a spinny ambush. Ambush. So, yeah, no right. tie, First but. Time. But Mike wins again. <laughs> I was going to say, for the first time, we don't have to roll. But for the fourth time, Mike wins priority. Yeah. First of all, Fear and Dead Men. Amazing artwork. And one of the best scenes in the Marvel Comics canon that has been shown for Vader to date. If you haven't had a chance to check that out, go. It, uh, the issue started in 2015. Go pick up that first, uh, those first six issues. You'll see what this card is all about oh yeah vader essentially gets surrounded by about 40 rebel troopers and he just uses the force to detonate all of their thermal detonators on their belts and kill them all <laughs> all i'm surrounded by is fear and dead men it's so good it's the most like yeah. BA line I've ever one yeah. of one of the most BA lines Vader's ever ever given out. Yeah, it's so awesome. It's also in this game the turn where you do not mess with Vader because it's a it's a either a lose lose or a win lose. Yeah. You shoot yeah. out of, there's there's no winning on that one. Yeah, Vader, you're only hurt yourself, right? I mean this is just Jace just having a string of like well used command cards and just keep yep. it going. It's been a it's been a really solid flow and I think it's been paying off for him really, pretty well. All right, all right. So Droidic is here triggering the AI attack. Looks like they might be shooting that two man shore unit or yeah, looks like they are. They have a guy on the yeah one on the steps and one on the ground floor there. So Mike coming in with a shot here. Can I see both? I'm yes. waiting. I'm waiting for Mike to have a good like a like a an above average Droidica roll. He's he's due for one here so. That will be four. That looks. That looks like maybe it. Yeah. It yeah. Looks like it. There you go. Just, just <laughs> calling it. Ooh, I obliged you with three blocks. And they get taken away. <laughs> Saves are out of control. Someone check and see if Jace might those dice. It's Sean's dice. It's Sean's dice. They, they are actually all my dice. <laughs> okay. Well, somebody check and see if they. We're gonna need a cup of salt dice. water. We're gonna need to get a cup of salt water and see if those dice are balanced. I need a salt water cup on on <laughs> yeah. on site. I mean, yeah. <laughs> We'll, uh, I just we'll, I don't think Jace has rolled a blank on shore troopers this entire game. Nope. Vader has <laughs> taken more wounds combined yeah. than all the shore troopers have. Uh, let me let me just nuts. let me just uh, give you guys a little tip here. It's uh, it's five seconds per side on medium to high heat. Just just saying. <laughs> okay, fair enough. Standard advice. Uh, yeah. <laughs> all right. Looks like Jace is. Uh, Gonna go with that shore unit? Yeah, the, hitting the one, one hour. <laughs> hey, we we got to turn four, so we're we're still doing fine. Mike's staying in this here. Rally one again. Rally one's gonna slide in there. There we go. Thank you. Great. But thanks, what's Vader, the, for not letting us. What's the one action? 
Just run away. <laughs> or run, run away run, and win. Run away. Yeah. Yeah. Protect the protect oh. the objective. It's the smart thing dead. to do. Oh. There's a dead church. Yeah, that, nice. guy, broke that guy trip, tripped and fell, broke his neck. You know, uh, sometimes Bob, it happens. Uh, just so you guys know, Bob Swain, I'm not 100% sure what I got points for, but I have been awarded a point. So I think technically since the, game, yeah, since the game is not over, I am actually winning right now. Yeah, <laughs> Fantastic. <laughs> Could you tell the players to scoop those dice, Sean? Oh, yeah. Can you guys scoop the dice? Well, I actually can make it disappear here, too. So there you go. They're gone. Oh, uh, that yeah. works. I can do it. I just have to then remember to put it back up. So it's uh... <laughs> all right. There we go. So a uh, Mike is uh, checking here for validity of targets. Doing some surgery over there. These guys help each other out. Yeah, yep. I like that. Yeah, Bob. I don't know if you can hand out points to uh, to a fellow judge, but show me show me in the document where you can do that. I'd be interested. So, are they Listen. going for Vader here, it looks like? Are they trying to peek around and take a shot at Vader? I think he looks, got him, man. Yeah, look, yeah, looks like he's, he do, yeah, looks like he's heavy cover on Vader there. Listen, if uh, Vader drops his box, uh, seven, it's not seven, in a good, seven, you know, the Shores have to run way over to Yeah, they have to get all the way over there and grab And that, that Courage bubble disappears. So, yeah, there you go, a, Mike. Yeah. yeah, there you go. Uh, yeah, all, and, yeah, anytime you can make him roll a uh, save, though, right? Yeah. That's obliging with. There you go. Now. Yep. Takes a wound. Yep. Wow. Well, he no, should have spent that dodge. He did not spend the dodge just because it was the only the one coming through there. So right. I think that's probably not the time to spend the dodge. There yeah. Could be just in case those other B ones roll around and. Well, I don't know who's gonna get leverage. Yeah. Who's gonna there get there shot is on no. Him? Yeah. There is no other real Same. shots. So that might have right. been, but. Uh, nah. But maybe, but maybe Jace plans to go with him. Maybe not end around, and maybe he's going to put him in a, a little bit of a different spot. So, Jace forgot who his red dice are rolling to oh, save. Yeah. They're not rolling to save Vader. They're rolling to save the short troopers. Man, just the the B ones getting aimed shot by the mortar here, and we're just going to see a bunch of suppression coming in this turn, I believe. Yeah, one crit There's coming a through there. Natural crit. Yeah, so just, just one, one crit. Just one pretty after there. Yeah. And uh, does take one a out. wound. One yep. at a time. Two suppression. Ship away. Yep. yep. Oh, he was going on that command squad up there. Yeah, yeah and command if squad they, up. Now, yeah, yeah, okay. Notably, if they panic next turn, they drop the box, and then they that's won. definitely yeah. game. Yeah, at that point. 100%. Yeah. yeah, looks like Mike is opting to go with... Three yeah, three uh, three droids down here. They're really kind of blended in. Both uh, both bases really blending in with the to Matt there. So um, we'll talk about Matt's next week. But we should uh, just so you guys know, we do have a Friday night uh, fights sponsorship by Deep Cut Studios. So um, big shout out to them. Uh, next week we should have one of their mats featured on stream. So I didn't want to put that deep cut up just to confuse you that this is not a deep cut mat here. But next week we should see those. So uh, stay tuned for that. Yeah, I've gone through their uh, their site. They got some really good looking stuff on there. You know, you know. Actually, shout outs to those guys again because there's one thing I've I've actually been looking at, and they have this cobblestone mat. I was highly considering it for my Naboo table, but if you look on their site, they actually Ringo. Hey, that's sorry. double crit. That's double crit. I yeah. was gonna say Ringo, my man. If you, yeah, <laughs> uh, failed save. Ouch. Just, just but, checking, uh, Mike. Uh, have you rolled a block tonight? Uh, only when it hasn't mattered. <laughs> He's rolled like three. Jeez. Yeah, I know. They've been brutal. Yep. He's rolled a couple of surges when you Anyway, sorry, Joe. Go ahead. You were talking yeah. about uh, Cobblestone Matt. Yeah, yeah. So, Cobblestone the, so, so, so what I want to say about the... They, they actually offer, if you look on their site, and I, I think it gets a little expensive, but they offer custom mats. Yeah. And the one thing I was thinking, I'm like, man, if I could take that existing Cobblestone mat, and if they can, like, Instead of it being like a dark gray, it was almost like a tan or almost like a salmon color. Yeah. And with no, no other changes, I think oh, it would be. Oh, he does it. Oh, he really doesn't perfect. run. No. no. Doesn't run. Does not, oh, does not, run. not run. They rally. Yeah. Mike, there's your blocks. I found it. Man. Mike, you were Look at him go. Now you did it. It's made it. Yep. Now what's he going to do? Not that it matters, but what's he? What's that? That's, that's Is he the, moving to go punch the. <laughs> I think he's going around him. Those B1s carrying this. Oh my gosh. 
Those B ones carrying the sigil of House Green. Get out of there, man! Go. <laughs> yeah, that's tuck in, tuck, tuck in deep. Oh, hey, that's man. the place I love to see. Hey, yeah. I mean, back up a turn. I was saying, man, if you can get around that do back, I mean, it's still there. It's turn. It's turn four. So, I mean, I this B one. Right, I, I want to see him make it so bad. Yeah, I mean, turn five, you the get there. Turn six, favorite, turn six, you get a uh, tuck tail and run in right into that crevice. It's there. Uh, nothing. And oh, did you have a hit there? Yeah, three blanks. Okay, yeah. So the one suppression from the suppressive weapon there. So they should be at five. Yeah. So Joe, what I was gonna say was that's that's what I was looking at on their uh, on their site on uh, Deep Cut. They have the uh, custom mats on there. You might yeah, try and yeah, see if you can do like the tan yeah, bricks and see if they'll take it. I don't see why they wouldn't. Because I, I, I the feel same like price, if I think. right, if you're gonna do, if you're gonna offer a custom service, you could probably make uh, yes. modifications to your existing patterns pretty easily. Right. Now, what I did so, see that I would totally do, and I'm considering getting one myself because I'm I'm always in the market for new mats because I, I I love variety. If you've ever seen any of my hero figures, they're all magnetized all to heck because I I can't make choices. Uh -huh. I have everything, so I gotta have all these mats. And what they and what they do is not only do they do custom mats, but they do custom double side mats. That's cool. And those are awesome. I have a double sided mat that's a grass and a desert Second on action. the other side that uh, I've seen a lot of people have because that's just a really good. It's a really solid map to have all the variety uh, with as few mats as possible. And I'm definitely, if I get another mat, I'm definitely gonna get another double sided one. Uh, from them, especially if I can custom choose, and they have so many different options. Uh, yeah. they, they all look so good. Um, just to let you guys know, it was a pivot move by Legend. Uh, then it was uh, Jace pulled a core trooper here, and it looks like he's going for a shot, maybe on the droid, because on the aim backside. Shot. Yeah, aim, aim shot on the backside there. Here they go. They got their shields back at least. The three coming in there so far, and then the aim shot uh, crit one there. So not sure if the droid is having any cover. I think, they're, I think they're open. Mike's opting yeah. to take all shields there. So yeah. Might, might as well. Yep. Yeah. Over to you, Mike. All right. Cool, cool. All right. Looks like Mike is. There you go. I guess you can Going see a little double a little, double little, move there. A little pick and pick. Was that a double move there, Mike? Yep. Yeah, double move, tucking up on the corner there. You're gonna go for Vader, I guess. Uh, I guess, yeah. Maybe. I mean, Vader's sitting on five wounds, I think, right now. So. Yeah. It's, it's a move. Yep. You can do it. All right. Uh, but Jace is actually going to go with Vader right now. So Mike's still sitting at three B1 squads, four B1 squads. Sorry, there's a single dude there. Two Droidica units left. Jace hasn't... Oh, actually, you know what? I should go over there. I need to update that because Jace has, in fact, lost that one do back. So I'm going to make sure I don't Looks miss like that. we have a little... Little shift in the UI on the left hand side. Oh yeah, oh yeah, you're right. That's me. Hold on, let me just. Uh, there we go. Good catch, good catch. Just a little bit of my mouse click. Uh, sorry, let me put that back up. <laughs> Jace oh, just casually yeah. rolled six wow. out. Ooh, Look and Mike, Mike and does. The yeah. Need the saves. <laughs> Jeez. Yep. Uh, just All right. the unit. Uh, yeah, it looks like they opted to not go here there until after the swing. Yeah, so. yeah. but he is on two there because he had the extra body in that unit. So, and Vader's safe for the rest of the turn as well. Yeah, I mean, there's really nothing else to shoot Vader. To be perfectly honest, the three B ones at the bottom that are touching the dude. That's I mean, about it. Yep. Mike. Mike, uh, you go for the swing Mike here. really running out of. Oh, I know Jason's Mike first. running out of objective directors. Yeah, he mean, is. This, yeah, this might be a good play. All right, trying to find dice here, and critical three on the Yeah, three coming in. Yeah. Yeah. Hey man, those those are the dice, and uh, that's, that's there uh, they go. That's a unit. 
Uh, whoops, that's not the right one. Mike, uh, which unit was that? Was that the... Those ones over by the drug. Uh, uh, yeah, the do they have an uplink in them? Yes. Yep. Okay, yeah. I did, sorry, I meant to... Uh, oh, yeah. Just, okay. just which unit are they on the uh, overlay here? There we go. All right, Mike is, in fact, running out. I mean, when the side's all red, that's all she wrote, folks. I think... Do... Yeah. Reposition? Yeah. Reposition there and then crash in, but uh, won't be an attack here. Yeah, and that's yeah, that's right. exactly what I was saying at the at the beginning of the turn. Looking at that at that do back, I was like, he's gonna blast the one squad and yeah. crash into yeah. the other one, lock them in melee. They can't do yeah. anything. All right. That's so sad. I wanted to see that B one do something. Just, and and you know what, man? Jay's going B1's, for the cla claim there. I've yeah. seen B ones be caught in this position yeah, before with awesome. Tauntauns as well. It's yep. creature troopers. Yep. Once they crash near B one line, it is not a happy They're spot down. to be. No. Yeah. For sure. Yep. All right, and that's uh, players sweeping uh, tokens, so let's hop back over. So, um, hey, uh, just if you guys don't mind, just while we're doing that, you guys can continue. Um, Joe and I missed this last week, and we're going to show it at the end, but we did want to uh, give a shout-out to all of our Patreons and uh, show supporters. So if you guys can bear with me while I quickly run these end credits, sh uh, not at the end, but uh, here we go. So big shout outs to all of our sponsors. If you look real quick, Mike, you might see your name on there. Fantastic. Yes, I'll run that again at the end of the show, but we did miss that last week, and my apologies. Uh, we did go back and make a much more creative end credit for you guys. So uh, once again, thanks to all the supporters of the show. Like I said, you guys make this happen, so we are happy to bring this uh, to you. So, okay, guys, what do you think about that? It's turn four wrap-up going into turn five. Mike's running out of activations, running out of hands. Jace has yeah. got three objectives right now. Mike's sitting on one um and then one's unclaimed with very little hope for that single b1 to get there right i mean so jace has the massive lead on points i just think he needs to hide and protect his bodies at this point why throw points away he's gonna win um and if he's gonna take shots i would just take him at b1s i would ignore the droidicas because they well, don't care. Vader. You don't. You don't care about their suppressive keyword because Vader's still healthy. True. You're still in his bubble, but and if you delete the rest of the B ones on the table, there is literally no way Mike can win because he can't pick up the objective yeah, with anything. And so, if I'm Jace, I'm probably just taking my short troopers, shooting the B ones that I could see, and then moving behind a line of sight blocker. At this point, it's sad that the, uh, the there there was never. Sadly, to say there was never, it didn't really feel like a back and forth at any point. It kind of just felt like from the get go, the Empire was, the Empire marched in and took this game like out, yeah. of, out of turn one. Yeah, it's true. And man, losing Grievous that early is really, really what did it, I think. Mm -hmm. Once I saw that happen, I said, yeah, this, yeah. Is, this is Jace's game. You just got to play it safe for the rest of the game. Yeah. Yep. So, but definitely really some solid Empire tactics for those of you watching. I know we just did a, a whole episode on the Empire and, you know, I, we didn't have the best things to say about like do backs and stuff, but Jace definitely showing us how it's done. And, yeah, you know, we, absolutely. Yeah, we talked about how we think Vader is his way to do back. Certainly you're seeing it. So if you want to watch some interesting Empire plays, or this, yep. this the match. Yeah. For watch sure. Him, watch how and they if, can uh, just and if you ever wanted to see short troopers run at like maximum yeah. maximum efficiency, can you, can you tell I a user? if you're if you if if you've been if you've been on the fence about short yeah, troopers, let let this be a let this be a demonstration yeah. as to show you how they can just like, dominate the board with the dice and let them. Well, yeah. yeah, I mean, there's ways to make them more like, ridiculous, but not since January. Right. But offensive push and spotter, like yeah. you know, they just uh, get kind of. Yeah. Even I with think, just 21s, they can do it. Yep. Yeah. yeah, I think players are ready here, so I'm going to throw up a turn five counter here, and we'll go to the cards. Players are ready. Just got to flip. Yeah, he's updating his Instagram here, so there we go. Master of Evil yeah. standing orders. Yeah. kind of feel like that was a force play by Mike there. Maybe not a choice play, but... Yep. if. 
if those B ones are in range, it's not looking good. Nope. Oh, because I believe it is range three for Master of Evil, or is it range two? I think it's just range. I think it's range two, two on Master of right, Evil. Eh? Two. One to two. Yeah, yeah, I think it's two. Do they have it? Well, we can uh, check some and, range and bands it, here, but yeah, even I'm if gonna not. Doesn't really matter, but yeah, the guys on the rock. I'm not sure if they're quite in range two. Range two. Yeah, they are. There you go. So oh, he did it. Yeah, he so, you know, so Ouch. they'll they'll Ouch. start off with a casual seven suppressions. So. <laughs> Yeah, you said it earlier, Joe. This has been a solid play of the uh, the of solid flow of the Empire's command cards. Just like straight in one turn to the next, it's it, like it's just the perfect command card the for just slowing right and taking choice. out. The, yeah, yeah, taking that uh, taking the um, the droids down a peg. It's literally putting on a clinic on how to play Vader. Like, yeah, it really is. Like, yeah. All right, so it looks like uh, we have crit one. So yeah, it looks like three, maybe three total. I can't see if there's another one under there. It looks like four total. Yeah, four looks total. Like, yeah, yeah, four. Yeah. Interesting, Jace levered uh, choosing to not go with Vader first, but I don't think he yep. really needs. To. Oh man. Uh, did yeah. you did you refresh a shield at the yeah. end there? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. He's so, still so good, so that yeah. Nordic is yep, not looking down. good. Mm -hmm. yeah. He's down, and oh, that last one is sitting on one wound, I think. Oh, man. Yeah. Uh, Mike going to go with... Yeah, Joe, the next time I see anybody in uh, in the Legion page asking, like, hey, is it possible to win with Vader, or is it possible to win with Dubat? I'm just going to link him this link video this right yeah, yeah link. I was gonna say just link them. Like, like, hey, you want to want to see it done in like an hour? <laughs> like, yeah. yeah. Here we go. Uh, there's a decent rollout there. Three coming at. Uh, I think this is into the full shores there. He didn't have. Oh, he he moved up. Sorry, he did have range that single shore trooper. And back up to five suppression again. Yeah, looks like he made the save there and takes a fifth suppression. Which we'll have to check on range there. Yeah, yeah. Mayor, I was gonna say I, I bet they're still in range, but if they weren't, boy yeah. howdy, that would have been yeah, a, for that sure. That would have been a different game. <laughs> but you know, you know what though, you just he is he's out out of enough. range. He's in range. He's in range. Okay, yeah. Okay. Uh, just yeah. go to go to a stick three. There we go. It's yeah, you just activate Vader and back up. Back him up, right? You yeah. just get the suppression bomb off on the objective carriers. Yeah. Which likely is going to cause them to panic. I mean, unless a miracle happens. Mm -hmm. I'd say at this point, when those shores get their one action, I would just recover at this point. And Vader just, like, scoots back twice, throws his saber, kills that droidica, and says, hey, I'm safe. He's, and he's good, yeah. Yeah, and I'm still protecting. And at that point, who even cares if Vader dies after that? It's All right, so this is back just finishing off this last <laughs> lone V1 that I really uh, wanted to very, see grab that box. Yeah, very likely going. All right, make all three saves, buddy. Aw. Oh. Uh, <laughs> Man, those dewbacks just chewing those B ones up, eating them for dinner. It's nasty. Oh yeah. 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 Hey, Robert in the chat uh, saying that Vader's always been good. It's the rest of the list that determines effectiveness, in my opinion. Hundred percent agree, man. Yeah, I agree. I say that and uh, that and familiarity with uh with with how he with how he rolls because you can definitely overplay the aggressive factor on Vader and get him in a position where he might not want to be in. Right, and, and really his yeah. biggest weakness is his activation count. I mean, yeah. so I think two two dewbacks is actually oh, a decent choice for a Vader. Short troopers are pretty much staple because they're so good. Yep. And, I mean, you can literally turn those two dewbacks into a single ATST. I've seen that exact list run. And yes, it's down and even, it's even lower activation, but that list does some work as well. Yeah. Doesn't matter. Gotcha. Sure. Yeah. So those those droids just threw punches at Vader, did nothing, and then dodged. Which, right. sure, if Vader like blanks out all his dice, I suppose. 
Yeah, maybe they'll maybe they'll live, but I they're 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 as good as dead as soon as Vader activates, unless he just backs up. Does he have push? Does he have an untapped force push? Uh, I have has, not seen force has, push yet. He has yeah, push so. reflexes saber, so we might actually see the push there instead of a disengage or. or that's, a, uh, that's yeah. That's, I think that's what I would do and kill the Dracica. Yeah. Hundred points is a hundred point. Like yeah, and you got saber throw too, so. Yeah. Uh, one crit here coming. I think of that top Droidica from that mortar, and he's down. Okay, doesn't doesn't even need to do that. Man, Droidicas are literally the thinniest models. Mm -hmm. yeah. I have a hard time keeping them glued to the bases because of the how tiny. Yeah, the there's just are. just the tiny little little little. Point feet. It's, it's almost like you need to use some pin. texture paste or thing. Pin, pin. Yeah, like pin them. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Definitely right. don't magnetize them. No, <laughs> they'll right. just fly right off. Unless uh, that's how you want to answer your glue problem. All right, here's uh, here's Mike going. Are you outrange, Mike, or not? Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I was just curious what he was, if he was or was not. This was a choice move or a forced move. Choice. Fair enough. <laughs> All right. Okay, no less dose. All right, that's what's no happening right now. Here we go. Oh, so right, who are we shooting at? Yeah, we we shooting at the dewback the there. Yeah. Dewback. Uh, dewback shots coming in here. And Bang! Dewback spikes three, and Dewback just saves it. This is right, saves yeah. all. Sean, I like your dice. I know, man. They're fanta <laughs> fantastic. <laughs> fantastic. They only lose on initiative rolls. Hey, Sean, how much? How much? How much are those dice going for well, on the Leech black market these I days? Uh, well, probably significantly more after this stream. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I agree. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> just uh, the same thing that you're donating yeah. on the PayPal. Inquire yeah. within for the dice. So, stock is <laughs> up in Sean's red dice. That's yeah. for sure. Yeah, sell, sell, sell. Add to Sean dice. Yeah, yeah. Uh, they'll save for you unless it's Vader or Initiative. Yep. I mean, you want to go they second choose, anyway, you know, right? What they so choose. you yeah, want right, to go yeah. second, right? <laughs> totally, totally. Yeah. All right, Mike going with his command droid unit. Does not roll off. Yeah, does not roll off all of them is what I was gonna say. Yeah, I mean he's at least he was only rolling four, not seven, so. Uh, we got a cool overlay that can kind of help us out with the range three there if you guys want. So he is in fact closer to the other edge, but uh, overlay helps us confirm that. They're moving. Yeah, they, they were. They, they, they had to panic. They panic, yeah, exactly. Yeah. So, I mean, they just panicked into range, further into range two of Vader for the suppression bomb. Oof. All right, Joe, my real question uh, is what's Ringo doing this turn? Oh, oh man, that mortar. They're showing uh, up Ringo. Also, uh, for sale, white dice. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> right. More than white dice. Yeah, yeah. The Ringo white dice. Oh, so that's the reason. Yeah. Man, that wasn't him, though. The other mortar? We'll yeah. shoot them as well. Golly gee. Oh. Droids are out at this point, so now it's just all, it's just all Jace. Yep. Yeah. Uh, I think we can call it Jace. Good game. Yeah. But. Mike scooping. Yeah. Yeah. There's literally no way I can come back now. Yeah, because yeah. Vader's going to hit yeah. them. Box is dropped. Yeah. Actually, yeah. I, yeah. actually I force pushed them out. Yeah. yeah. You just force push them out. Suppression move. suppression bomb, yeah. and hit there's the, no, there's nothing happening yeah. on six turn. Suppression bomb, right. them, move in, hit the deck is with six. The only card I have left is implacable, so I win priority, and I just eat the deck is and my shores. And yep. Thank you for awesome. Well, well, there you well go, played. boys. All well right, played. I'm going to jump jump back in the booth here so we can wrap that up and I'll let the players kind of clean oh, yeah, up sure. their uh, their stuff. So, oh, well, thanks, everyone, for coming into uh, chat. Please stick around just for the end, end game wrap up here, of course. Um, super appreciative. I'm just going to give a rundown of the totals. These are impressive, boys. 362 thumbs up tonight, 277 on the hearts, 171 on the cries. 
141 on the shock faces and another 177. Oh, I guess we had crying laughs and 177 on the crying. So most of the cries were probably due to my jokes and uh, and all the various things. But awesome, or, or just awesome. Just watching those blanks, those blanks it's, get rolled, man. Exactly, yeah. uh, exactly. But so. hey, it was, it was a fun game to watch and a really good pace. And we finished in what, like an hour and a half? Yeah. Uh, no, I two hour and a half two, game. Two, yeah, that, that, two. 2.30 on the clock, I guess. So technically just, yeah, just but under the two-hour mark. Yeah, cut off half hour when yeah. it was really like eight minutes in. And yeah, we were probably yeah, under the, uh, sure. under the well, we can we can just tell by stream time anyway, I guess. So somebody could probably yeah. give us the exact uh, timing on that. So yeah, fantastic. Uh, just checking out here uh, in chat. Good game. Nice game. Um, yeah. Robert saying here, a buddy of mine crushes his bad dice by using a hammer on them. Oh, hey, that's I, fair. Oh, I I used to I used to say what I was gonna do is grind up the bad dice and sprinkle it over the dice that were left and say this is a lesson to the rest of you. Roll better. Oh god. All right, well, this isn't safe for kids anymore on YouTube. Yeah. This is morbid. If you buy enough core sets, right? You, yeah. Yeah. Dice yeah. To cycle through. Yeah, yeah, for sure, for sure. Probably so, I mean, I give my dice a redemption arc. My, my dice got a redemption arc in, in Muncie. They, they, they failed me at Gen Con and then redeemed in Muncie. So, I mean, if they, if you stick with them, you know, show them some love. Give them a yes. chance. The classic hero's journey. Yeah, <laughs> give them the hero's journey. Don't just yeah. shred them and make, make, put them on the front page or put them in the obituaries tomorrow. Jeez. Cool. Yeah. Oh, man. Hey, so just, just to give an update to um, some of the stuff we got in the works uh, on the Legion Academy side of things. We've got some objective tokens and some new deployment markers in the works. Uh, we put up a poll on Patreon. I think the poll is literally tied right now. So we're, we're, we're going to produce both anyway. But uh, I guess we'll have to do like a, a, a roll of red coin flip on stream or something to determine which one we'll release first. If you guys uh, haven't checked out our Patreon, you can join our token subscription. Get all of those coming your way. And... Uh, Look out for some new content. We got a, I know Dice Time's got some more stuff in the works. We've got a stream on Tuesday. Uh, stream on, about stream on Thursday. Stream on Thursday, right? Yeah. Like a bunch of streams because we got some news coming down the pike from FFG pretty soon here. Or yeah. I didn't see that. Mm -hmm, uh, right. Hopefully we find out what Clan Ren does. I'm pretty hyped about uh, Mandalorian. I, I need to know what Clan Ren does so bad. That's my most <laughs> anticipated thing this year. I bet. I mean, you're Next the rebel. You're, yeah, you're the ladies, the ladies' night player, right? Imagine adding some uh, some more Mandos into that army. I, I mean, my number one, my number one thing. I'm gonna love. Uh, I'm gonna love adding the Mandos to. Well, first off, yeah, I'm totally adding them to Ladies' Night. I don't care how how they fit in. I will make them fit. Mm. Uh, second, they are gonna be the coolest thing to paint and kit bash. Church is gonna be super awesome, and I'm actually gonna we're actually gonna talk about that next time on uh, on uh, next time on Dice Time because it's mostly gonna be a hobby segment, or it's mostly gonna be a lot of a lot of hobby talk. Cool. Uh, and the other thing was we have a just a quick just a quick thing to let you know we do have uh, Act One of the ATST up on YouTube right now, and we just recorded Act Two uh, yesterday, so I'm gonna get that edited and get that in the works, and that should be up soon, so you guys can uh, check out the conclusion of that. Cool. Sounds good, man. I mean, um, I, I I got a question for Ben, and and uh, you know we'll get his email so we can direct all the hate mail. But I just wonder when that secret of a thousand or sorry, not a thousand, a million Cad Bane's was arriving. So up in Canada, we got delayed another week, and I think primarily they said it was because of secret that was going to Ben's house. So uh, we'll, yeah, so we'll have to see. Uh, I haven't I haven't received any email, uh, any confirmation email of my five million or however many Cad Bane's, however many they're allowing me to to, to buy. Yeah. Uh, we're yeah. gonna see. I'm going to Muncie tomorrow, so we'll see if they do, if they delivered any of them to the to the store. Uh, awesome. If some people walk out with them that aren't me, then uh, we made a mistake somewhere. But uh, you know that's all right. It, it happens. Ben's Fantastic. just opening an Etsy store where he's just selling <laughs> objective tokens of Cad Bane's hat. Yeah, I'm yeah. just gonna have Cad Bane hats up for yeah. sale. Yeah. Um, I should give a little preview to uh, next week, uh, and of course everyone's still invited, so we can we can have as really as many people in the booth as we like. But uh, next week Keith is uh, going to join us over from Jedi Hunter to do a little bit of calling oh, with awesome. uh, with uh, with. Joe and uh, I don't know what I, I don't know who's playing exactly yet, so we'll figure it all out. But I, I think I think Jace uh, might come. I think he said he's got a double heavy uh, imperialist, so maybe back to back imperials, um, and then we'll see what we can uh, we can do.
do about rustling up an opponent uh, here. So um, we'll do our best. And then I think the week after that, I'm going to see about jumping on stream, maybe to roll some, uh, maybe roll some droids or something. So I will, okay. uh, I'll try to avenge the, dro uh, avenge the, uh, the droid brethren here. And uh, there we go. Go buy some new white dice, clearly, so because mine weren't bailing Mike out at all tonight. So, <laughs> <laughs> but uh, that, well, either sweet. either that or go play some clones, because I'm pretty sure with those red dice, no clone would die in the entire game. <laughs> yeah, right, so. right. That, <laughs> right. That's, that's how you win right there with clones. <laughs> yeah, so we'll we'll have all kinds of excitement. But uh, fantastic, uh, guys, we appreciate that. 25 plus people all night tonight, which is fantastic. Thanks for spending your time with us. We know you could be doing other things, but we are happy that you were uh, here with us. So I think we're going to sign off here unless you guys got any final comments, but please stay tuned. I'm going to roll the end credits. And again, want a big shout out and acknowledgement to all the supporters of the show. So we will catch you guys Thanks. next week. All Cheers. right. Have a safe and great week, everyone. Have a good one.